71% of the Earth's surface is ocean, a vast ecology that can be sustainably cared for the benefit of all, but instead is under constant threat, and the demands continue to rise. Our generation needs to find solutions. The answer to the riddle that was hidden is now seen. 80% of the sun's energy that reaches the Earth daily is stored thermally in our oceans. The tropical ocean zones of Earth have stored thermal energy equal to 10,000 times our current demand. This stored energy can be tapped by pumping up cold, deep waters to warm surface waters for ocean thermal energy conversion, a non-polluting, carbon-free source of energy for the whole world. The cold deep water is rich in accumulated nutrients for growing plankton and krill in surface waters that can restore fish stocks and enrich the entire marine food chain. This nutrient-rich water can grow macroalgae like kelp, which can become fish feed for aquaculture, clean biofuels, and valuable marine co-products such as pharmaceuticals and seafood products, thus providing energy, food, and desalinated water to meet the needs of our world sustainably. Learn all you can, then you can truly build. Pioneering this revolution requires research to be conducted in deep ocean water under real conditions. Researchers need to have the capability to monitor, test, and optimize OTEC and other ocean technologies for the best practices in sustainability while protecting the environment. For all this, we need a research platform. Even a small coral polyp can grow into an island. A Pacific International Ocean Station is proposed to have an OTEC core with living and working accommodations for researchers, crew, and visitors. This ocean station will host international teams under a cooperative agreement in which the resulting knowledge is shared with all countries across the globe. This deep water station would ideally be located in the Hawaiian Islands 200 mile exclusive economic zone beyond U.S. territorial waters and whale and fish sanctuaries. Hawaii is located far from any conflicting national boundaries in a tropical thermal zone and in open ocean waters that can support a broad span of marine life. Imua. Moving forward. With success in finding the best practices for stewardship while protecting the ocean ecology, the Pacific International Ocean Station can serve as a pilot facility, leading the way for clusters of ocean farming communities and perhaps even ocean cities. This may ultimately serve as a model for regional sustainability and international cooperation for all the countries of the world. This is our vision for a blue revolution, meeting humanity's needs through sustainable use of our ocean resources. Taking the first step requires bold vision and the courage to sail beyond the horizon toward a bright future 